Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for September 9th of 2025 is titled Up from the Earth, Gigantic Jet Lightning. So what do we see here? Well, here we see an image taken from the International Space Station, and you can see a portion of it there off to the right-hand side. We can see Earth, including the curvature of Earth, demonstrating its spherical nature off in the distance. Up above it, in that slightly green-tinged, is actually the atmosphere of Earth. So, Earth's atmosphere there, the green tinge being what is called air glow, caused by light from the sun that strikes Earth's atmosphere and energizes the atoms, causing them to glow. Now, what really stands out here at the center of the image is what is known as giant jet lightning. Now, this is a relatively recently discovered phenomenon and only known for about the past couple of decades. And they are jets of material that are associated with thunderstorms, so it is tied into thunderstorms. But one thing that's a little bit different, they go upward from Earth. So instead of going down, and we tend to think of lightning as striking from clouds, striking to the ground, this lightning actually moves upward and goes up into the upper atmosphere and the ionosphere around Earth. And we can see distinct and how powerful this jet of lightning must be. Now, this was imaged back in July from the International Space Station. So astronauts looking out there were able to capture this and get an image of this relatively recent phenomenon, trying to hopefully better understand it. Of course, the more observations we can get, the better we're able to understand things like this. So really, we've seen these and detected them for the last 20, 25 years or so, and have a few different images. Of course, catching something like lightning is often, you have to just be getting there at the right time. You have to have a camera ready because by the time you have time to think about it, the lightning can be gone. Now, these jets actually can reach up to very high distances in the atmosphere. And in fact, we can talk distances of about 90 kilometers or about 55 miles above Earth's surface. So they aren't just going a little ways up. They are shooting way up in toward the ionosphere of Earth, well above Earth's surface. And we can kind of see that in the image. We can see how long that lightning is stretched out. So much less than you'd normally get from a thunderstorm that where clouds are much closer to Earth's surface and the lightning discharges down. Downward. In these cases, it discharges upward, giving a much more larger and giving it the name of gigantic jet because of how large it is. So, again, studying lightning here helps us to better understand lightning on other planets, which does occur as well. And when we look at lightning on other planets, we can hopefully get some ideas of how the lightning works on Earth. So that was our picture of the day for September 9th of 2025. It was titled Up From the Earth, Gigantic Jet Lightning. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.